Experts say it could take two to three years for the majority of the global population to be vaccinated against COVID-19. And during that time, the virus will mutate and possibly re-enter vaccinated countries. Scientists are now working on adapting the current vaccines and possibly creating a universal vaccine. Our Yi gyang has the details. The COVID-19 vaccines are being delivered, but the world is now in a new race between the coronavirus variants and developing new vaccines to tackle them. To stay ahead in this game, countries are speeding up their vaccine rollout to achieve herd immunity as fast as possible. According to The Economist, the UK, European Union and the US are expected to achieve that by the end of this year. South Korea is also aiming for the same, but it could take until mid-2022 given the slower start, just like Japan. That is a similar time frame as major economies in other regions. And it could take even longer for emerging economies and much longer for poorer countries. Scientists have been warning about this vaccination inequality. If vaccinations don't go together globally, new variants will continue to emerge in certain places and enter into already vaccinated countries. That is why scientists have been tracking the genetic code of the virus to detect the most dangerous variants, like the strains first found in the UK, South Africa and Brazil, and upgrading their vaccine developments to try to catch up with the virus's mutations. The current vaccines are not fully effective against the South African strain. They might offer some protection against the UK variant first found in Kent. But another new strain in the UK could potentially harm the effectiveness of the current vaccines. The solution to this problem may be the so-called universal vaccine. The University of Nottingham and Scancell are working on a vaccine that targets the core of the coronavirus. The RNA part of the virus doesn't mutate easily. So, if developed, it could work against all variants. But the effectiveness of this type of vaccine remains largely uncertain still. The scientists are aiming to develop what could be a pan-COVID-19 vaccine within a year. Young-un, Arirang News.